Rolls-Royce is known for its luxury cars. The new boat tail looks exquisite, it is a successor to the gorgeous swept tail that was produced in 2017. The swept tail cost $12.8 million. The company hasn't announced the pricing yet, but the rumors say that the boat tail is supposed to be a whopping $28 million. The exterior of the boat tail is two-toned, which is not seen on many cars, the finishing is high-end, and the interior comes with a hosting suite with a built-in sun umbrella and champagne fridge. Who doesn't love champagne, right? Rolls-Royce never disappoints. A once-in-a-lifetime experience. Coach Build presents individuals of extraordinary achievement, culture, and vision to craft an entirely original motor car and stake claim in the mark's legendary history. With Coach Build, one realizes a dream in partnership with the world's finest designers, engineers, and artisans. Bugatti La Voiture Noir comes with the quad turbo 8 liter W16 engine. It produces 1,479 horsepower and 1,600 newton meters of torque. One can find it hard to believe, but this car comes with six exhaust tips. The swanky new Bugatti La Voiture Noir comes with radical wheels, the fascias bespoke, and the badge at the back lights up to spell the name of the brand, making it evidently Bugatti. La Voiture Noir is a tribute to the history of the legendary Bugatti. It stands for sophistication and elegance. It brings speed, aesthetics, luxury, and technology, and is nothing short of an icon. This all-black Atlantic is priced at $18.7 million. With its homage to the fourth, all-black Atlantic, missing since the Second World War, Bugatti is bringing the speed, technology, luxury, and aesthetics of an icon into a new era. But the customized creation of La Voiture Noir is far more than a modern interpretation of the ghost of the Gran Turismo. La Voiture Noir is a tribute to Bugatti's own history, a manifesto of the Bugatti aesthetic, and a piece of automotive haute couture. The Senta Deci is a really rare car, it was debuted by Bugatti in Pebble Beach Car Week. The Senta Deci builds on Bugatti's 110-year tradition of excellent design and performance, while also honoring the brand's recent heritage. Bugatti designed a recreation of the Apocal EV110 with the Senta Deci, Italian for 110. With its astounding performance and pioneering design, the Senta Deci, inspired by the historical model, challenges all bounds of creativity. The Senta Deci, with its modern version of the classic wedge shape and the renowned W16 engine, tastefully ushers the EB110 into the new millennium. There are only 10 units produced and the 10 limited edition cars are distinguished by their flawless elegance and sculptural beauty, transforming the Senta Deci into a true work of art. The car is one of the most exclusive cars ever made, and it is priced at $9 million. The Chiron goes up to 261 miles per hour, while the Senta Deci is limited to 236 miles per hour. Plus, Bugatti claims the Senta Deci hits 124 miles per hour in 6.1 seconds and 186 miles per hour in 13.1 seconds. But based on car and driver's Chiron Sport test, the less powerful hypercar can hit those speeds in 5.7 and 12.9 seconds, respectively. For the Mercedes-Benz Xelero is a one-of-a-kind vehicle. The Xero was created in 2004 by Fulda, a German division of Goodyear, to test its new tires. Mercedes based the Xelero on the Maybox frame and equipped it with the same twin-turbo V12 engine that produces 690 horsepower, 510 kilowatts, and 1,020 newton meters, 752 pound-feet, of torque. This supercar is carefully and flawlessly engineered to prevent aerodynamic stress. As a result, it will be able to achieve its aim with the greatest efficacy and efficiency possible. The Mercedes-Benz Maybach Xelero Concept Automobile is a powerful and large car that weighs 2,660 kilograms, 5,864 pounds. The Xelero is a car that reaches a top speed of 351 kilometers per hour, 218 miles per hour, which is extremely fast in comparison to other concept cars. The Mercedes Maybach Xelero accelerates from 0 to 100 km per hour, 0 to 62 miles per hour, in just 4.4 seconds. The supercar is priced at $8 million, but today it would cost more than $10 million. The Maybach Xelero is a one-off high-performance sports car made by Stola, now part of Bliotech in collaboration with Daimler, Chrysler. The Devo is a staff favorite among Bugatti's newly released automobiles. The Devo has a lot going for it to justify the extra money, even though it shares a lot with its cheaper companion, the Chiron. 
Bugatti made the Devo 77 pounds lighter than the Chiron by adding lighter wheels, a carbon fiber intercooler, and deleting some sound deadening. Despite having the same 1,500 horsepower, 1,119 kilowatts as the Chiron, the Devo has a different aerodynamic arrangement that makes it 8 seconds faster around the Nardo test circuit. The moment you've been waiting for has finally arrived, the car will be produced in 40 pieces, each costing $5.8 million. Trevita is a Swedish acronym that means three whites in English. The Koenigsegg visible carbon weave bodywork is famous for its distinctiveness and perfection all over the world. Prior to the Trevita, vehicle manufacturers only had access to standard black carbon fibers. For the Trevita program, Koenigsegg created a unique coated fiber solution that converted the fibers from black to a gleaming, silvery white. When the sun shines on the Trevita, it gleams as if millions of tiny white diamonds are embedded within the visible carbon fiber bodywork. The Trevita is equipped with a twin carbon rear wing, Inconel exhaust, carbon ceramic brakes with ABS, airbags, paddle shift, chrono instrument cluster, multimedia system, tire monitoring system, and hydraulic lifting system. The Trevita was initially planned to be a three-piece limited edition. However, because the Trevita's white carbon fiber made it incredibly difficult and time-consuming to produce, the decision was made to make the automobile even more unique by limiting the number of Trevitas produced to just two. This limited edition model is priced at $4.8 million. Lamborghini has not only marked the 50th anniversary of its founding, 1963, with the Veneno and Veneno Roadster, but has also given birth to a highly special few of one that has taken the notion of a super sport roadster to the next level, breaking all limits with the world of racing. Between 2014 and 2015, Lamborghini produced only 14 Veninos, based on the Aventador. Each one cost roughly $4.5 million, depending on the features chosen, and came in both convertible and coupe versions. Under the hood, Lamborghini installed a more powerful version of the Aventador's 6.5-liter V12 engine, which now produces 740 horsepower, 552 kilowatts, and 509 pound-feet, 609 newton-meters, of torque, allowing it to reach 60 miles per hour, 96 kilometers per hour, in 2.9 seconds. It is the costliest Lamborghini ever built. The Lamborghini Veneno is recorded as the fastest Lamborghini ever made. With a top speed of 356 km h 221 miles per hour, the Veneno could go from 0 to 60 in 2.9 seconds. The Veneno is a limited edition car that was unveiled on the day of the Lamborghini Motor Company's 50th anniversary. Bugatti drew the attention of the entire automotive world when it announced that a customized version of the Chiron had broken the 300 miles per hour barrier. The Supersport 300 Plus is a road legal variant of that car created to commemorate the event. The Supersport 300 Plus, which is limited to just 30 units, is a stunning version of the Chiron, with fluid, sliding bodywork and a nice striped theme. Despite the name, Bugatti is restricting each car's top speed to only 277 miles per hour. The bodywork on the Chiron Supersport 300 Plus has been stretched and aerodynamically designed for extremely high speeds. Performance and stability are enhanced by a perfect blend of minimal drag and downforce. The supercar is priced at $3.9 million. Bugatti has made only 30 units of the Chiron Super Sport 300 Plus Hyper Sports car. Bugatti announced that it has delivered the final edition of the Chiron Super Sport 300 Plus. The Sun is a bridge to Lamborghini's future in varied ways. This wild-looking Lambo is the brand's first production electrified option, despite being based on the Aventador SVJ. The San has a 48-volt mild hybrid system in addition to the 6.5-liter V12 from SVJ. The total system output is 819 horsepower, 611 kilowatts, making it Lamborghini's most powerful vehicle ever. Lamborghini will only construct 63 models, as shown by the 63 stickers on either side of the San's wing, each will be significantly more expensive than the Aventador SVJ, which would set you back $3.6 million. The first open-top hybrid Lamborghini Super Sports car to feature a supercapacitor, the San Roadster roars with electrified intensity, resonating with the inimitable V12 sound from the most powerful Lamborghini engine to date. Limited to only 19 examples, the San Roadster advances hybrid technology with the world's first use of a supercapacitor in a material science application unique to the industry. 
following Pagani's lead, a Roadster version of the fearsome Huayra BC was a done deal. The Huayra Roadster BC, a topless monster with 800 horsepower, 597 kilowatts, and 774 pounds to foot of torque, was unveiled to mark the occasion. Surprisingly, Pagani increased the Roadster's horsepower by 50% above its coupe sibling, thanks to an AMG Source twin turbocharged 6.0 liter V12. Owners should find comfort in knowing that their automobile is ultra rare, in addition to the satisfaction of hearing the magnificent engine note without a roof in the way. Pagani is only making 40 of these cars, each with a price tag of $3.5 million. Unique and gorgeous cars from various motor brands may be found all over the world. These automobiles, on the other hand, are exquisitely designed.